This is the Forestry Pro, a three-point hypsometer from Nikon. Now inside here we've got a clinometer and laser rangefinder working together. So if we use high points, low points and horizontal points, we can very easily and quickly find distances and heights of objects. The front houses the monocular lens and laser, so not recommended to look down there when it's on, and the receptor underneath. A CRT battery fits snugly into the body here, and the two buttons on top, power and mode, that are used to operate it. There are two LCD displays, the external one is used to show the results, and the internal one, viewed through the eyepiece, is used to set your settings, as well as actually take the measurements in the first place. As for using it, it's very straightforward. Hold down the power button and both the external and internal displays will switch on. The first thing to do is determine which mode you want to use. By default, it's set to record the linear distance, the distance between the device and the target you're aiming at. To change mode, press down the mode button for half a second and it will rotate through the different settings. Horizontal distance, height mode and the angle mode height between two points, which I'll be using later, and finally, height between two points and the horizontal distance. Now, if you hold down the mode button for a little longer, a couple of seconds, this changes the units of measurements, yards, meters, or if left blank, in feet. And finally, the last thing to check is the priority mode. Now, when you take a reading, you may get several conflicting results. So say you're trying to record the height of a tree which is behind a fence, you need to determine which one you want to use. And that's what priority mode does. So you can choose between distance, which will take the furthest measurement away, so the tree, or you can use first, which will take obviously the first object it comes to, which would be the fence in this scenario. And to do this, you need to press down the mode button and then quickly press down the power button afterwards. Keep both of these pressed for a few seconds until the internal display switches to the new priority mode. As for taking the actual measurements, it's simply point and click. Now I'm doing measurements to check the height between two points. So I simply need to find the lowest point and press power to take a reading. Once that's done, I simply scan to the higher point and do the same. And while you're taking these measurements, the external display will also be updating with all this information. Now it does automatically turn itself off after 30 seconds of inactivity. So make sure you've got a pencil and paper close by to put down your recordings. Hope that's helped give you a slightly better insight into the Forestry Pro. And if you want to find out more, just simply visit the website or give one of our team a call.